Now, this will be very interesting indeed. How will she cope with the uh, very below par performance that she gave yesterday? She is the reigning European and world champion. And it has to be said in the six minute warm up for the free program, she was struggling. Her timing didn't seem to be as good as it would normally be. What's going on between the ears of oh, Elizabeth Tuktomisheva for Russia? program scheduled to be triple axel and she made the rotation you could see she was slightly off axis she'll lose a bit in the goe but it looked to be rotated to me now that's more like it beautiful triple looks at the beginning of that three jump combination Flip next, and again, cleanly done. Well, that is a huge combination just into the second half, so she gets an extra 10%. Two, triple toe, triple toe. And the looks on its own. Just hangs on. towards the end of the program. It's home and dry now. difference a day makes that was much much better from Elizaveta 
technically the program in a class of its own from anything we've seen so far. 68.79 at the moment, look, almost 10 points clear of the leader. But I've got to say, is that program good enough to win her a world title again? Well, there were times when the music was playing and her skating wasn't yeah. really relating to the music. No, I'm with you, 100%. The, 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 the lady was, uh, was shrill and, and high up there and doing it, and the arms were moving and there was no, the two didn't actually fit together. So, it'd be interesting to see the, the overall presentation, Mark, because uh, particularly on the performance execution, uh, we don't see that because it's embedded within the overall second mark, but uh, uh, there are things in there that have a, a lot of room for scope, a, a lot of scope for development, but some of the elements, the triple toe, triple toe is fantastic. We will be able to see that. We will be able to see it. So I'm interested in the performance execution, the third of the five different elements within the presentation score. And also the interpretation. Yeah. That's, uh, and the choreography. That's in it. Yeah, it could it could impact across all of them. The the five splits in that second artistic mark are um, skating skills, transitions, and linking edges. The performance and execution, choreography and composition and interpretation. So the judge is looking against those uh, little segments, if you like, within the whole. And and sometimes it does change. Sometimes I kind of see them and they they kind of got an overall mark across, but sometimes it does move up and down. The top mark, bottom mark, mark are taken off of the judges. It's averaged in there. We see an overall mark coming up. Yeah, I hope so. I mean, there's no doubting that she's got fantastic skating skills. I thought the transitions in the program actually were very good. But I'm with you 100%, Nikki. For those second three points of that component score, I would really have questions. You can see she's fully rotated on that triple axle. Couldn't control the landing. So uh, she should get the base value. And then the judges will give uh, a probably at least minus twos on the grade of execution. Much better on the three jump combination. Triple looks, double toe, double loop. And here's that huge combination right in the second half. That was the start of the second half of the program. Triple toe, triple toe. Much, much better from the world champion. And you don't get to be top of the tree unless you've got fight in you. And that's what was shown there. So 114.97 will put her in the lead. I'm sure she's going to do better than that. The pre score. Here we go. Yeah, 133.62. She goes shooting into the lead. You can see the second mark not quite as good as the first. Technically, it was a very, very high score indeed. And uh, we haven't got the breakdown on our screen at the moment. Stuck in cyberspace at the moment, but uh, no doubt she leads.